of St. Louis Blues fans returned to the scene of multiple crimes. Parking areas targeted by thieves earlier this week and last week welcomed back hockey fans tonight. Fox 2's Jeff Bernthal reports on some noticeable security changes. We are near 15th and Poplar. One of the big noticeable changes, you can see very visible police cameras right next to this lot. We also noticed other security measures as well. Some fans arriving for Thursday night's game also had security on their mind. It was unbelievable. Connor Curley walked out to this lot after Tuesday night's game to find car windows shattered and cars broken into. You never know what's going to happen. We've just been talking to coworkers like, are we going to go back and park there? And so I did today and then I saw a spot on the street. These police cameras are expected to help. I wish they had some folks out here walking around during the game watching things too. A police presence and security inside the lot were visible Thursday. Fans hope there's more of that in the future. Just wish that the city would take more efforts to make us all safe. and when we come down here. Get some more officers and more patrolmen. Area law enforcement has seen a spike in car break-ins across the St. Louis area. Multiple agencies announced plans this week to try and fight the problem. Oh, well, it makes me a little nervous, but I'm kind of hoping that since it's all, all over the news, it's kind of like maybe uh, there'll be a little extra paying attention to it. I feel a little bit at ease because I do know about it. It makes you a little bit nervous, but honestly, I'm really excited for the game. And when you're not left with a lot of options, what are you going to do? I think it'll be okay. We parked closer to the fence area there, and it seems guards there, and it seems pretty well lighted, so I think we'll be okay. Fans say they've seen plenty of security around Enterprise Center and hope there's even more attention given to parking. Keep people's stuff safe, because if it's getting broken into and all that, everybody's going to steer away from it. Earlier this week, the Enterprise Center and the St. Louis Treasurer's Office shared statements with us about these crimes. You can find those at fox2now.com. Reporting from near the Enterprise Center, Jeff Bernthal, Fox 2 News.